Stacy, I stand here for you today, about to marry the girl of my dreams. This is something I always thought I would never do, but falling in love with you has definitely changed my mind. So to the great love story of Stacy and Shay, here we go. You don't find love, of course, it finds you. It's got a little bit to do with destiny, fate, and who you flat with. Chapter one of the great love story began when Stacy moved in with some random people that she'd never met before. When Stacy first moved in with us, she was completely sworn off men. That lasted about a week. During this week, Stace would often tell us that um, she wasn't interested in anyone anymore, you know, I'm never gonna go back there, I'm an asexual now. We just keep telling her, just wait until you meet Shay, like I really think that you'd get on well with him. I don't know where we got this idea from, but we just really thought that hit it off. A week rolls round, and they met at a friend's birthday party, um, and I kid you not, they were literally like teenagers. You give me your number. No, you give me yours. They were talking through a gate. Now, Shay likes to pipe in at this point and say that Stacy was desperate. <laughs> well, Stacy puts it slightly more eloquently in that she had met some losers in her past. So it's been about four years since then. Look how far you guys have come. From renovations at Atherfold, buying your first house together, Stacey one day deciding that she didn't hate dogs anymore and instead loved them so much that they must spend $900 on this dog and he must be called Quinn. <laughs> Stacey, I love everything about you. You're beautiful. You still don't know how a guy with a mug like me got a girl as stunning as you. I love how you're hard working, except on Sundays. <laughs> but I hope we can keep having that same argument for the rest of our lives. You laugh at my jokes even when I go too far and you just get mad. <laughs> I know you're still smiling on the inside. <laughs> Stacey, I promise to be by your side and to work hard and provide for you and hopefully soon our own family. I haven't gone and said all the traditional vow stuff, as I believe it goes without saying, or neither of us would be standing here today. Stacey, I love you more than kept words can describe, and I can't wait to start our next chapter of life. Shay, I promise to love you, honour you, but not obey you, because we all know that's not me. I promise to encourage you to always follow your dreams because I know with you we can achieve anything. In sickness and in health, I promise to take care of you even when you've had one too many rums the night before. <laughs> For richer or poorer, I promise not to spend all of our money on fancy dinners and wine. Now I'm a lady of leisure. <laughs> and finally, I promise that no matter what, I will be by your side through whatever our lives may bring. You are the love of my life and I love you so much. <laughs> Turn me on, come pick me up